Okay guys, uh, in this video I'm going to show you how to repair the fuel line on the trailer. Uh, this is 2019 trailer. Uh, so I spotted uh, from the right side mirror um, the, some kind of grease like that. I just cleaned it. But uh, anyway, uh, it was the night time. I was going to refill the tanks. And... Uh, um, I saw inside was all, um, um, you know, the fuel was leaking, so I couldn't find where was the fuel was coming from. It was one of this line, but my reefer was turned off that time. Um, it was on cycle mode, and then uh, I got my flashlight. It was night time, so I started looking for the uh, the cut or a crack. And as soon as it started, uh, the uh, the unit uh, it started leaking, and um, I'm lucky that uh, this one was coming from here. So uh, then another challenge was I couldn't repair that on the on the road. So it was not emergency; it was not leaking that bad, but it was still leaking. Uh, came home, and uh, it happened to be on the weekend. Everything is closed, but luckily. God bless the um, Home Depot. Uh, got uh, so I went to the Home Depot and the local store, and uh, so you need a coupling, uh, brass coupling, and they did have it. So many people don't know about that. So uh, if you guys know, what you need is the eighth, uh, uh, the three eighth uh, inside diameter, which is that that big. Okay, has o-ring, uh, brass o-ring when you remove this one. Anyway, uh, so I got this and it was like a $7. This one is the quarter inch uh, pipe, quarter inch pipe. I cut this one from this line. Okay, and uh, it looks like uh, they're using the nylon uh, air hose um, uh, fuel uh, Fuel, they call the fuel lines, but this one is used also for the airline because I got exactly the same material. Um, you look at that inside, it's like a uh, two layer, uh, two uh, can focus, yeah, two layer. Um, uh, the hose, nylon hose, the white inside and black outside. So I didn't know that until I cut this one and I compared the one I got it from the guys uh, they were working on the weekend so this is the same same kind of thing um, and the three uh, the quarter of the inch pipe nylon pipe and uh, uh, you can use that for the fuel as well and uh, even the seller uh, the, the guy who was selling the parts they said that they are the same uh, it could be uh, they may have somewhere the specifically different material for the fuel but what they use is the same material at uh, right now I compared the apple to apple and uh, th this one uh, did last about uh, two years three years actually since I had this trailer and uh, I don't know what cracked this one here probably the uh, the uh, weather change or um, the temperature change uh, I don't know uh, this is the winter time right now but uh, anyway so um, I got this uh, uh, the quarter inch hose uh, with a 3 8 diameter I got this fitting I mean coupling uh, at the Home Depot and uh, you need uh, to wrench this one is a 9 16 and uh, five eighth. Okay, this one is the this one here is the five. Uh, what was it? Nine nine sixteenths. Yeah, and a five eighth. So I got this also from the whole uh, the uh, Harbor Freight. Those wrenches. I'll show you. Here. Uh, you got it. Have this one in the truck. So th this side is the metric or vice versa here is the regular imperial so uh, that was like a twenty dollars it was worth it to have it okay and uh, uh, that's all you need uh, and uh, this is very handy you gotta have that in the truck okay uh, this one cuts 
straight uh, it has a lot of stuff uh, it was uh, $12 something uh, at the Home Depot very very crucial tools okay if you don't have it you're gonna get stuck or uh, um, you gotta go to the service you can do that it took me 10 minutes to do that uh, unless you don't uh, include the uh, parts to get it so uh, actual job is 10 minute job it's not leaking it's working fine I don't know how long it's gonna last but it's gonna last as long the uh, original manufacturer design so this is that's what I was gonna show you guys uh, that's how easy you can fix that